Today, I'm going to be talking about free tokens, which are all exchange tokens, which I think could do very well this bull run, ranging between a 30 to a 100x on these gems. Make sure to stay tuned, and I'll be sharing them with you today. But before I do, guys, this video isn't financial advice. Also, make sure you are subscribed to my channel if you are not already. I upload every single day on my channel, daily live streams, daily videos, keeping you guys updated with the latest and the greatest gems. Finally, make sure to check out that Patreon page. It's linked in the description. There's a whole plethora of benefits if you join this group. Buy alerts, sell alerts, full traceability of my portfolio, educational content and private groups and much, much more. Check it out, linked in the description. Starting off with the first project, we have Trader Joe token. The ticker for it is simply Joe. I think this is the lowest risk token out of these three. I think it can easily do a 30x on your money, maybe even more. It has a 67% circulating supply, a $79 million market cap. And essentially what this is, this is the DEX token for Avalanche, Arbitrum, and BNB. So you've got a triple threat in terms of the fact that this is built on a layer zero in Avalanche, a layer two in Arbitrum, and a layer one in BNB and Ethereum. So you've got some very good things going on with this project. I like the fact that it's got Arbitrum as one of its kind of networks for the DEX. I think Arbitrum is an upcoming layer two. I think it's going to have a huge ecosystem by the end of the bull run, and it already does. Avalanche is an interesting one. If you're bullish, if you're bullish on Avalanche, then this is probably going to be a, a really good play for you as well. And BNB, we know, is probably going nowhere. So I think this is a good project. The DEX is really, really clean. I use it myself. You can swap tokens. It's not difficult. It's basically like a pancake swap, but it feels even fresher than a pancake swap. You've got a liquidity pool here. You can earn fees, basically. You've got staking, and you've got, obviously, NFTs on the platform as well um, with the JPEGs. So you've got different NFTs, um, different you know companies come and put, put in their NFTs on the platform, which is really good to see, particularly if you are bullish on NFT technology and just NFTs in general. In terms of the chart, I actually think right now is probably the best time to buy Trader Joe, and that isn't financial advice. We saw a huge pump earlier on this year as we saw the launch of Arbitrum, and now we've come down a lot, and I think this level is a really good time to start DCAing in if you haven't already, and that is the reason why I'm putting you aware to this project. $70 million in market cap, as I said. If it does 100x, you're getting a $7 billion market cap. I think that's a bit ambitious, but half of that, 3 billion, I think is very realistic. So a 50x is certainly possible on this gem. But if it was me, I would probably start taking profits around a 30x just to be on the safe side. Very good project, not going anywhere. And I think people are going to start buying the tokens. On to the second project, we have Sourcer Swap. Now, this one's a little bit higher risk as it is only one um, kind of blockchain that it, it that it encompasses. And some would say that HBAR isn't even a blockchain. It's a hash graph. So it doesn't even encompass a blockchain. But essentially, Sourcer Swap is the DEX for Hedera HBAR. If you're bullish on HBAR, you're going to be bullish on Sourcer Swap. Whatever gains HBAR makes, Sourcer Swap is probably going to do more. So if HBAR does maybe a 20x, I would expect Sourcer Swap to probably do like a 50x, probably double, triple, or even quadruple whatever HBAR does, you would expect the DEX token to do. You can see as well that it is backed by the HBAR Foundation, so it's fully legitimate. Also, it's been audited by Hacken, getting a score of 9.7 out of 10, which is a very, very good score. I think it's a genuine project. I've used it before as well. If you want to buy the token for Sourcer Swap, you can either buy it on MEXC or you can buy it through Sourcer Swap itself. Um, both are fine, but I think this one's going to do very well. I called this one all the way down here. We're up 2x in my Patreon. So if you do want to get easy 2x gains, double your money, you put five grand in, you take out 10 grand, definitely join this Patreon group. However, I think Sourcer Swap is just at the beginning of its rally. And I think this bull run, we're going to see some major, major moves with this project. It's sitting at a market cap of just 11 million. A 100x on this would be a $1 billion market cap. I think that is actually possible. But like I said with Trader Joe, I probably wouldn't be waiting for a 100x from here as I'm already up 2x. So if I get another 50x from this level, I will be up 100x and I'll be pretty happy with my investment. So Sourcer Swap is definitely one to watch. You can see it's got all the tokens um, on the HBAR ecosystem. 
You can see the token utility here. You've got liquidity. You've got staking, governance as well. You've got the DAO as well as payments. So a few different things in terms of token utility. You can go and read the white paper. You can go and read into it more. I'm just putting you guys a word to these projects. It's now your job to go and do your further research before obviously going ahead and buying them. On to the third and final token, we have Swarm Market Token, SMT. Now, this isn't a DEX, but it's still an exchange. And it's not just any exchange. This is an exchange for real world assets. So you can essentially trade real world assets on the blockchain, tokenized, seamless, and simple. I'm going to show you how it works right now. It's a very simple platform. You open it up. It looks kind of like an eToro or one of those trading platforms that you use for stocks. And you can see very simply, you connect your wallet, whether it's a you know wallet connect, maybe a trust wallet, a MetaMask, a Ledger, or even a Trezor. And you can go ahead and you can start buying these tokenized assets. You've got the Ethereum network and the Polygon network, which is very good. You can see, I think a lot of them are on Polygon. You've got for example, Apple stock, you can literally buy 100% real equity um, in Apple stock tokens, which is absolutely amazing. You've got Solana liquid staking, so you can do staking on here. And you've got Coinbase um, and NVIDIA. Now, I believe they're going to be bringing out even more things on this platform. I think they're going to be looking at maybe implementing things like loads of commodities. So it's not purely stocks. You could have gold on here. You could have silver. You could have all sorts of different tokenized assets. You could even have property, diamonds, and things like that. So I really like the idea. You can see how the tokenization is done. You've got the asset. You've got the custodian. It's off-chain, and then it becomes on-chain, essentially, by Swarm X. So there's a bit of technological complexity to it. You don't really need to fully understand the technological complexity. But what you do need to understand is that this is a big narrative People high up in the U.S. financial system are talking about tokenizing assets. Lots of people are interested in it. Swarm Markets is a clear platform. I believe it has regulation as well in some way, shape, or form. Don't know exactly how, but it's a solid project. You can see here the estimated tokenization of global illiquid assets is going to be increasing. You can see all the way up until 2030, they're expecting it to go up basically hugely, right? They're expecting tenfold returns by 2025 as well. So tokenization is a big trend. I've listened to the people behind this project talk as well. I think they did something with Cheeky Crypto. So they're getting themselves out there and talking, which is good for transparency reasons. I think it's a solid project. Only a 2.5 or 2.2 rather million dollar market cap. 2.2 million dollars. It's absolutely tiny. Very, very small. If this wants to do 100x, you're talking a $200 million market cap. I think that is absolutely feasible, if not much higher. So get your eyes on this project. I'm not telling you to buy it, but go and do some research. Check it out. I think a lot of money is going to be made. That's going to be it for this video, guys. If you did enjoy, make sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe if you are new. Also, check out that Patreon page. I literally just dropped a buy alert over in my Patreon. You can see it says just now there. I literally just dropped it. Go and check it out. I think this project's going to do really well. In order to unlock these buy alerts, in order to get these nano caps, these micro caps, and even sometimes high and mid caps, become a Patreon. You need to join that elite tier or above in order to gain access to buy alerts. But that VIP plus tier is the one that most people go for. That's the active one. That's the one that by far the majority of people join because it gives you access to that VIP Telegram group. It's a super active group. We're doing calls in there. People can talk to me on a voice call. I'm reviewing your gems in the chat as well. It's really, really active. There's loads of insightful information and smart people in this group. But you don't just get that. You get that. You get my buy alerts. You get my sell alerts, consideration alerts, and much, much more such as daily webinars and content. Check it out, guys. Loads of benefits. If you want to be even more serious, for the most serious amongst you, Go for that everything tier. Go for that VIP boss tier. This one gives you one-to-one -one calls. There's only 10 slots remaining. So if you want that most tailored kind of mentor tier where I act as a mentor for you, this is the one to go for. Only 10 slots remaining. It's going to run out pretty fast. So join it while you can before the prices rise for new Patreons. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.